Hi, this is Ashfaq Margub, and welcome to this case-based learning podcast regarding a lesion that reveals shiny white areas, a few blood vessels, and milia cyst. This patient presented with the stable lesion on the cheek. It has a slightly raised border with an indentation. This is the dermoscopy view of the lesion. Here's your differential between a benign melanocytic lesion, a melanoma, a benign non-melanocytic lesion, a basal cell carcinoma or squamous cell carcinoma, other or inflammatory. Give it a thought as to what this may be. What are the structures one sees? The lesion has a shiny white background with multiple milia cysts and a few irregular linear vessels. On biopsy, this lesion revealed cords of basaloid cells, some calcifications, and thickened collagen. Here are the cords of basaloid cells on close-up. This lesion proved to be a desmoplastic trichoepithelioma. This is a lesion that typically occurs on the face, and the lesion is usually of long duration and stable. It can be slightly erythematous and often has a raised border with a central indentation. Dermoscopy features classic re reveal shiny white background with multiple milia cysts and vessels, some of which can be arborizing. These lesions are benign and they do not have a risk for malignancy. Here's another case with a lesion on the chin with a raised border, a central indentation. What are the structures you see? Once again, there's a shiny white background. There are a few milia cysts and arborizing vessels. Once again, on pathology, this revealed a desmoplastic trichoepithelioma. Yet another case of a stable lesion on the forehead. Notice the raised border, the central indentation. What are the structures on dermoscopy? Once again, multiple milia cysts and a shiny white background. This lesion also revealed features consistent with desmoplastic trichoepithelioma. So what is the differential for lesions that reveal a shiny white patch with milia cysts and vessels? It is between a desmoplastic trichoepithelioma and morpheiform basal cell carcinoma. Here are three lesions revealing a shiny white background with irregular vessels, some of which are arborizing, and multiple milia cysts. In all three cases, the biopsies revealed basal cell carcinoma of the morpheiform type. So when you see a lesion that reveals shiny white areas with milia cysts and vessels, you need to have a differential between a desmoplastic trichoepithelioma and a morpheiform basal cell carcinoma. The key difference between the two is duration and stability. Namely, desmoplastic trichoepitheliomas tend to be of long duration and stable lesions, whereas morpheiform basal cell carcinomas are lesions that have changed over the course of time. Thank you for your attention, and I hope you found this case-based learning of desmoplastic trichoepithelioma helpful.